Hey guys, welcome to a new video. Sorry, I couldn't do a video on Sunday because I was sick. So let's dive into DaVinci Resolve to show you how that effect is done. So first of all, what you have to do is, you know, if you have a song, mark some points as per the beat. So I have already marked some points. So you can press M on the keyboard and you can leave such markers. So you'll have an idea on where you have to do the cuttings. So let's uh, let's start from here. So this is where I want to start the next clip. So I'll just leave it like this. And I want to make cuts here, here and here. So about three cuts will be done here. So let me make a cut here first and the remaining cuts we'll do it later. So right click new fusion clip then come to fusion right click open and fusion page this is a very easy effect actually so what you have to do is you know uh, under fusion uh, you can bring in any sort of masks so let's try this rectangle mask here i'm going to bring this here join it like this and you can you know adjust your width and the height as per your liking somewhere like this let me change it to a single window right here and then copy this rectangle copy and then paste it here and then just join it like this and in this rectangle what you can do is you can move it to some other position for that you can just play with the center slider x so i'm going to move it something like this and then again copy and paste here and join it like this and this time I'm going to move it uh, to the right, something like this. So once you have that one, what you can do is you can make the cuts now. So I'm going to make a cut uh, somewhere here, one cut over here, some cut here and then I'm going to move around and just recheck if the beat is going well. Now what you can do is come to Fusion and select Clips, so in the first one I want only the first rectangle to be visible so you can delete the second one second and the third one and in the second cut you can leave it like that as it is so you'll have like something like one two three now let's try one more example right here okay and now what you can do is you can bring in the next clip and do the same exact steps so let me move it as per the marking now what I'll do is I'll make a cut here and same thing, right click, new fusion clip. And this time I'm going to be drawing a polygon. I'm going to be bringing a polygon mask and press invert under this. You can just draw a polygon as you wish. I'm going to draw something like this. Now copy this one, paste, join it and move the center like this uh, make sure the invert is checked off once your mask is drawn now again copy paste and something like this then i'm going to bring in an ellipse node and join it like this decrease the size and put it something like this you know you can play with whatever mask you like you can even do magic mask and isolate the subject you can do all sort of stuff now let me make the cutting maybe here i'll make a cut then here then here cool now what you can do come to fusion bring in clips and in the first clip i want only one polygon to be visible so delete the rest and in the second one I just need two so you're gonna delete the third and fourth masks and in the last in the second last I'm going to leave everything except the last and in the last one you leave everything as it is so now you have something like this so you can play around with all sort of masks and create such unique effects well, I hope you guys learned something from this video uh, sorry about my voice it's kind of uh, 
uh, just healing i had literally no voice for the past two days and it's it was very difficult for me to speak so that's pretty much it for this video for those who don't know i'm fanzer i do travel tech and filmmaking on this channel so if you're into that sort of stuff please consider hitting the subscribe button thank you all for watching and i'll see you all in the next one